Okay, guys, <clears throat> it's coffee o'clock. What are we having? Okay. Yeah. I've been having that all week. It's empty. So what, what we're going to put in this? Uh, I am feeling. I'm feeling this one. Yep. Let's go. And there we go. Job done. Hi guys, how's it going? Welcome back to the Saturday Shave, eh? Another Saturday, another shave. I nearly forgot the clap, do you know? Somebody messaged me once and said, I just love that clap at the start of every shave. There you go. Quick edit today. We are using this bad boy. Check this out. This is 26 millimeter Fantorian knot. Let me get it the right way up for you. Sawdust Creations brush. I just thought it went really well with the label on today's so we're going to put that in the official John Shears 101 Super Soaker and then it won't even be one tenth of a second for you but it'll be about 10 minutes for me and we'll be back for the shave and just like that we're back how are you doing guys how are you doing first order of the day cheers everybody mm. you saw what coffee it is that's our SOTD our slope of the day but John, I hear you all ask, what are you nibbling with it? Look at that, no biscuits. So I went in the bedroom, I went in Angela's drawer and found, completely by accident, in Angela's sock drawer, this. Little bar of chocolate. So that's what we're on today. Okay, welcome to the Saturday morning shave. You've seen by the thumbnail, haven't you? We have got a good one lined up for you today. I'm sorry, that chocolate's really hard. Just let me get rid of it. Okay. If you've been watching my channel for any length of time, you may know, you may not know. My number one cologne, EDP, the stuff I wear when I'm going out, the stuff I wear when I want to smell good, the stuff I wear when I want women to go, oh, you smell so good. Is this stuff right here. Teddy Amez by Amez, okay? So anyway, absolutely beautiful scent. That's my number one cologne of all time. Now, when Johnny was doing love, right, so I got in touch with Johnny and said, can you make um, a dupe of this in a soap? And he said, no, I can't. Now, I have, uh, 10 years, I have been looking for a shaving soap that smelled like that. And there isn't one, guys. Or should I say... There wasn't one, but I found one a couple of weeks ago. Mr. Murray's grooming products came to the rescue. Let's have a look. I'll show you this first. And here it is. Mr. I like this box. I do. I like the box and I like the, the pattern and the iconography. Are you ready, guys? Check it out. Asgard's Casino and the salt is called Odin. The scent note there, grapefruit, black pepper, and vetiver. This is an homage, a dupe, whatever you want to call it to me. It smells exactly like, I'm getting it now. I've told, I'll go into it, I sprayed some of the cologne on my arm. Honestly, guys, they've nailed it. They've absolutely nailed it. Stuart up there, I think he's called. Um, there you go. And I've taken not a lot out. And I've put it in the official John Shaves bowl. Uh, there you go. We've put it in there. We're going to lather it up. You've seen the brush, haven't you? So I'm really looking forward to that. I've waited a long time to get my hands on a soap that smells just like this. And it smells phenomenal, guys. Turn your mezzo. About an hour ago, let it dry down. Leave it about 20 minutes, half an hour. Let it dry after it's dried down. There is very, very, very little difference, if any, between that and the scent on this soap, guys. we we'll put the scent strength at five. But John, come on, let's crack on. We're going to be using a timeless, because you need to be timeless, don't you? If you're going as God's casino. You see, I, I, it's all, all thought, guys. I think about it all. And I'm using RK blades. And do you know why I'm using RK blades? A lot of thoughts, a lot, a lot of thought, a lot of preparation went in this. Anybody guess why I'm using arcade blades? 
because the RK was in red. Hey, there you go. Come on, let's put that in it. These are good blades, guys. Um, if you've been watching my channel for any length of time, I know I say that, but right from the get-go, guys, right from the get-go, four or five years ago, when I first used RK blades, as a matter of fact, I think I was one of the first to say, these are really, really top quality blades. That sounded really, uh, mm, look at me, didn't it? It wasn't meant that way. I just meant, I think I actually was one of the first YouTube wet shavers to, to stumble upon RK blades. I don't know. John, stop digging this hole. There you go. Put that on there. I should have had my crown handle, shouldn't I? But there you go. We'll put that on there. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. We're going to put that in there in the you know, official John Shave Super Soaker. What's to do now? Well we'll, well, we'll lather up, shall we? I will wet the face so that all that love, luscious moisture can soak into those hairs. And then we'll lather up. How do we? How does Johnny do his badges? Here you go. Are you ready? This is the John Shaves 101. As gentle as you can. This is what... See, three flicks, some, some people say, but I'm as strong as Thor. Three flicks to me would leave this brush dry. So I've found, I just keep going like this, right? I know for the sake of the video, it's a bit time consuming, isn't it? Well, you see, very, very gentle then now. See when the water, when the water stops coming now, it's ready. Let's have a go. And we'll get that right in there. You will see it as I see it. I've never used this stuff before. Look at this, guys. Look at this. Absolute second. Never, this is my first time using Mr. Murray's grooming product. I bought this with my own money. He did send me a sample, which I am delighted to be using next week, guys. This, another another one, bites the dust. Um, but I'm not telling you about that till next week. Like, look at this, look, look. How long? We've been going seconds, haven't we? Absolute seconds. Well, what we'll do... I forgot I've to show you the website. I'm so excited about using this stuff. I forgot to show you. I think I forgot to show you the website. But look at just look at this. Look, guys. Look. Look, can you see the sheen coming off of that? This is really, really good stuff. I put that down there. Get my thumb, because it was trapped in the handle. Mr. Murray's Grooming Products website. Here you go. You go on there. It's £21.95. I would pay that for this all day long. No problem at all. So if you're in the UK, you're going to get a good deal on shipping as well. Here we go. We come down here. All been crafted with wisdom. Um, it, seven butters. It's got shea butter, coconut butter. Capuaco butter, cocoa butter, mango butter, bakuri and muramuro butter intertwined with the moisturising magic of jojoba oil. This fragrance is inspired by Terdia Mez, inspired by, envelops you in citrus notes of grapefruit, cedarwood and vetiver. I love vetiver guys, absolutely love vetiver. Let's come down here and see if there's anything else we can see. That's very briefly it. There it is. I will put a link to this website. It'll be the first thing you see underneath this video in the drop down bar. There you go. Um, I've no I've no affiliate. I've, I've done, I, I get nothing from it. Um, I've no vested interest. Everything that you see in here in this video will be as it is, in my opinion. Okay, so let's go. Come on, we'll wet the face again. We'll wet the face again. Look at this, look at this guys. You could just keep right on going, you really, really could. Okay. Wow. Oh. Okay, let's have a go. Mm. Thank you, Mr. Murray's grooming pro. I mean, I've been waiting years. I actually considered getting the Teddy MS bath soap, you know the bath soap? I was going to get that and try somehow, try somehow to cobble a shaving soap together. So desperate was I to get hold of this. 
Okay. Here we go. There you go. Well, first off, I can tell you it's extremely slick. It is. It is. It's extremely slick. Uh, an absolutely wonderful saw. Have I said the scent strength? I would put it about a five. Absolutely wonderful. Let me know what your shave of the day is. Let me know what your other SOTD is. What's your other SOTD? Your slurp of the day. I'm on Jam Shed. Later on, obviously, of course, I would never have one before one o'clock, say. Mm. Uh, yeah. If you've used Mr. Murray's grooming products, please let me know in the links, uh, in the comments below what you think. Uh, let me know what you think of today's shave. Uh, I have seen other YouTubers using this stuff. So I was aware of it, but I wasn't aware up until I watched another YouTuber about two weeks ago. I wasn't aware that they did this homage to Terry Amez. And when I saw that, my ears pricked up. So I got one. Johnny's little payday treat. Here we go. Mmm. Well, look, you can see yourself, look. This is absolutely wonderful. It just feels so slick, this salt. It really, really does. A uh, bit of a flyer on today. I'm a bit late out of the gate. I wanted to get this shave done and dusted by about 11. As I stand here now, I think it is actually just about 11. I've been covering in work. It's been busy, but not too busy. Um, you know, the work's been evenly distributed. But that said, you're still glad when Saturday comes around, aren't you? Look at this, guys. Very, very slick. Uh, it feels fantastic. It feels really good on the skin. Absolutely, absolutely wonderful. Here we go. Mm. I love that label too. I love the artwork. Uh, somebody did actually say to me when I started my channel, because uh, I love PA as well, uh, and I love, I love PA's artwork, and somebody commented, artwork means nothing, mate. It's all about the song, its performance, and he said, Although I can agree with that, I wouldn't say the artwork means nothing. I have bought soaps purely and solely because I have liked the artwork. I think it's a massive, massive part of it. I really do. Um, and I wish Mr. Murray's Grooming Products every success for a YouTube, which well, if you're not a YouTuber, you're in the UK uh, and you have a chance to please purchase some of this stuff. Let's keep this thing going. It, it's only going to get better, isn't it? Uh, a soap of this quality, with these labels and these scents. Um, we, we need to keep this going. Um, so, yeah. Absolutely. And that's it. Like I, I don't know how I said it. Please let me know what your shave of the day is. These blades are just fantastic, and they really are. They really are. I am. I'm a big fan of these blades. I am a big, big fan. Mwah. Wow, skin feels fantastic. Cheers, everybody. Happy Saturday, happy weekend, happy shares. Oh. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay. Let's have a look now. Let's get it. Look at this. Oh, we're at, are we on leather mittens? We are. We're on leather mittens, aren't we? There you go. Oh, my word. Look at this. Look at this, guys. 
Look at it. There wasn't a lot there, was there? You seen in the tub? Look at this. So, you know, if there is anybody out there who thinks, I don't really want to pay all that for a soap, you'll use half of what you would normally use as something else. So it's only 11 quid a tub, really, isn't it? That's the way I look at it. I look at it. Look at that. Yeah, we've just got the usual suspects. I'll show you this. Can you see? We can, get the, can we get the light to hit it? I don't know if it's picking it up, but the sheen, the sheen on that soap is unbelievable. Absolutely wonderful. Okay, there you go. So we'll get under here. The usual suspect. And we're all good. We're all good. No. Absolutely wonderful. Oh, looks fantastic. Smells fantastic. Oh, feels fantastic. We're all ready, aren't we? We're all ready for dinner. What am I having for dinner today? We've got some bacon in there, but do you remember I went on a recent trip to New York? We went to Sylvia's up in Harlem. Check it out, Man V Food, Sylvia's. We went to Sylvia's up in Harlem. And uh, we got some of Sylvia's pancake mix. Pancake and cornbread mix. You can make both with it, apparently. I might make some pancakes for lunch with that. There you go. Look at it. We did okay. Dare to find a hair. Okay. So what are we going to do? We're going to put some of this bad boy on. Look at that. Nothing. Not a zing. Not a sting. Absolutely nothing. The soap did its job providing glide slickness. And my skin feels pretty good as well, actually. John, what bar are you using? Hey, have you seen? Have you seen the thumbnail? Look, here it is. I got the balm, the TDMS balm. Uh, and there you go. Oh, absolutely wonderful. And we're done. Hmm. This is good guys, good, good guys, this is good stuff guys. Well, so it's about quarter past 20, past 11, I'll wear this all day. And this has inspired me so much when I get out of the shower later on this afternoon. I have a shower about six o'clock in the evening. I think I may just put some Terdiamez back on. We did okay, didn't we guys? We did okay. And remember, it's a lovely bright day out there. But we've got lovely bright hearts, haven't we? And when you've got a bright heart, the light shines. So be a source of warmth and light in a cold, dark world. Remember, someday, somebody out there, as a matter of fact, I would wager everybody you meet needs some love. So stand up today and say, I'm going to be the one today that shows it to them. Look after yourselves and each other. Um, and that's it. I will see you on the Wednesday shave. And guess what? Don't know what I'm using yet. But it's going to be a good one, isn't it? Bye.